That's my yacht. Wow. Do you still have it? Nah, sank it. Made me seasick. That's me dabbing on my tank. Wow. Do you still have it? Nah, sold it online. Those are my cool sneakers. That's my wolf. Those are my really cool sneakers. You've got a wolf? Canyon. He was like a brother to me. A brother who didn't wear pants. Wow! <laughs> it is an honor to be your friend, Daniel. Do you still have it? Whoa! Ah! Wow! Ah! It's him! I can feel it! <laughs> um... Are you sure he'll remember you? Nobody forgets Erico Platana. What's up, Canyon? Where's Daddy's big old wolfy wolf? You all right, Erico? It's fine. It's all good. This is just how we greet each other in the pack. Are you sure you're friends? Of course I'm sure. Relax. I can't wait to take him back to your place. You sure he's house trained? He's just getting his bearings. It's completely normal. What? Daniel, we said no animals in the house. You've got ten. I'll pretend I didn't see anything to get rid of it. One, I'll pretend I didn't see anything. Two, I'll pretend I didn't see anything. Is that a dog I hear? You know that's against the rules. We'll talk about it later. Bye! Maybe he can stay a little longer. <laughs> Did you hear that, Canyon? My best bud! I thought I was your best friend! Love Canyon, but uh, don't you think he's kind of uh, aggressive? You don't get it because you're not part of the pack, Daniel. Well, then, how come I'm always the one cleaning up his fur, cooking his food, and changing his litter box? Yeah, sorry, Daniel. Alpha males don't do that kind of work. <laughs> hey! Cool it, Mr. Canyon! I'm the one paying for your food with my own pocket money, you know! What up? <laughs> Headlowered, ears flattened. With this posture, the wolf shows his submission to the new alpha male. <laughs> Wait till you hear this. Canyon buried me in the garden again. <laughs> Can you believe it? You big bad wolf. Oh no, the bus! We're gonna be late for practice! Whoa. I like his smell. He smells like cinnamon! And torment. <laughs> Whatever. He's just a dog. <laughs>
Okay, kids, back to practice. Yay! Bye, Daniel. Bye, Canyon. See you tomorrow, guys. Hey, nobody forgets Erico Platana. I had to come by foot. By foot! Yeah! <laughs> oh, come on! Night, Canyon. Is he wearing a sweater with your face on it? <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. He's wild and free. Whatever. I understand Canyon much better than you do. They even call me the Wolf Child. Wolf Child. Me and Canyon, we're in the same pack. No bond is stronger than that. We'll see who he likes best. Here, Canyon. Come here, come here. Canyon. Canyon. You like me better than Daniel. Canyon! You like me better than that mean old soccer ball. You like <laughs> me better. Who's gonna be the cutest wolf in the world? Canyon! 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 <laughs> it's so obvious he likes me better. No way! So wrong! I'm taking Canyon for the weekend. We're going to the zoo for some male bonding. What? But it's my turn! We're invited to the neighbor's dog's birthday party! I think there's a little something going on between those two. Canyon would rather go to the zoo! You gave him... <laughs> you gave him cotton candy? How many times... <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you he's allergic? Baloney, he loves the stuff. <laughs> He really doesn't seem well. Should we call someone? Shame on you. What did you do to this poor hound? His chakras are blocked, his eyes are lifeless, and his hair is falling out. Like me. I can donate some of my facial hair. Once I actually grow some. Aww. This wolf needs a change. I'll take him to the park. And I'll take him to Ibiza. Jet skiing, all inclusive. Look, Daniel, that's no life for a wolf. He's meant to be with his own kind. Oh. In the wild. <laughs> Maple's right! <laughs> Sorry, Canyon! <laughs> Come on, he's totally fine. And if you don't want him anymore, I'll keep him. Look! You can see he's unhappy. No, oh, even as a cop, he was jealous of my convertible. That's us in the emergency room. He refused to let go of my leg. You were already inseparable. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think you're right, Daniel. The time has come for my best friend to go back to his first love. 
Mother Nature. Go on, Canyon. Go back to the great open spaces of the wild. I'll always be there for you. Even if I'm only your second best friend. If Canyon goes, you might get back to the top of the list. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. How did you manage to lose only one shin guard? Oh, I don't know, Erico. <laughs> well, let's take a look through my old things and see what we can find. Oh. <laughs> You're too young for this. Uh, this is not mine. Oh, I was sure I threw that away. Aww. Are these drawings from when you were a kid? No, that's from a couple years ago. Sketches from my graphic novel. You used to draw comics, Erico? Uh-uh-uh. Graphic novels, Daniel. I've always made time to explore my many talents. Erico Platana is a complete artiste. Joel, the cheeky squirrel. Oh, the adventures we had together. His best friend is a talking tire? You bet! This project was pure genius from start to finish. But anyway, that's all in the past now. Why'd you give it up? No time, Daniel. What with games, interviews, selfies. When you're a superstar, there's no time for hobbies. Too bad you stopped. You sure don't have those problems anymore. Maybe not now, but I intend on getting my body back soon. So get your butt in gear, Daniel. Even better than the real thing. Erico, look! I made myself a new shin guard. Are you coming? We're gonna be late for practice. Daniel, just in time. I need a fresh pair of eyes. You're back to the drawing board? I couldn't resist the call of Joel. I've drawn pages and pages since yesterday. It's like it was always in me. What do you think? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Well, it rocks, right? I've already called ten different publishers. Uh, um, the drawing of the clouds is funny. The fight scene? You're holding it upside down. <laughs> You know what, Erico? Comics are nice, but you already know where your true talents lie. Of course. How could I forget? Now I remember the scent of leather, the squeak of souls. That was my real passion, Daniel. Shoe making! What? Ha! <laughs> Graphic illustrator, what was I thinking? Being a shoemaker is my true calling. But what about practice? Not now, Daniel. I have to strike the leather while it's hot. But you'll come to see me play, right? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. I'll be there later. Okay, Erico. You're making your dad That's proud, my son. baby girl. Huh. Erico, you didn't come see me at practice. Daniel? Ah, just in time. The Welton gave me a stitch, but I got the upper hand at last. You made me shoes? Not just any shoes. Platanas. The shoe I've always dreamed of making. Stylish, comfortable, and high performance. 
I know. Breathtaking. Go on, try them on. Uh, I don't know, Erico. Go on, tell me what you think. It's just a couple hours' work, you know? <laughs> and a lifelong dream. <laughs> Well, am I a genius or what? There, uh... I've never had shoes like these before. <laughs> you better believe it. Good. I'll call the factory. Feet all around the world are gonna be singing my name. No! I mean, uh, shoemaking is great and you've uh, got a... Oh, got a gift. But maybe you should put that aside for the moment, you know? So you can concentrate on your real talent. Holy cow, Daniel. Of course. Now I remember. The applause, the glitz, the glamour, the beating of Dove's wings. Magic! How could I have been so blind? That's my true calling. No, Erico, it's fun. Abracadabra! <laughs> Okay, I might be a little rusty. Can you at least come see the match this afternoon? Yeah, yeah, don't worry. You promise? Yeah, 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 I promise. Is it this one? No. Okay, then. Is it this one? No. Oh, I must have dropped it. Huh? Of course! My nail arts kit! Huh? My makeup set? My hairdressing equipment! My old paintball gear! My DJ turntable! My ventriloquist puppet! What's up, Daniel? My propane barbecue! Oh, don't worry. I've got my volunteer fireman's helmet in here somewhere. Hey, what's this? Up around the edges, but inspiration takes time, Daniel. Sorry, Mr. Box, but you need to go away. It's better for everybody. Don't do it, Daniel! You can't throw me away like that without talking to Erico first! But he won't listen to me. You know how he gets when he's fixated on something. I agree. It's the only way. But if you do that, you'll regret it for the rest of your life! Don't pay attention to him, Daniel. You can never trust a puppet. But you're a puppet, too! <laughs> Daniel? Did you come to do some fly fishing, too? Hey! That's my stuff. You've got to stop this, Erico. Every 20 minutes, you switch obsessions. You'll never get your body back if you stop training me. I can't help it if I'm good at everything. Like I said, I'm a complete artiste. But you're not a complete artiste. You're not good, Erico. Sculptures are pretty average. <laughs> but at football, you're a genius. That's more than enough. Huh. Gee, thanks, Daniel. I thought we were friends. I'll see you later, dream crusher. Hmm. Fine, Joel, you win. Erica will never play football again. Hmm? Hey! <gasps> Can I help you? Or have you just come to shatter my dreams again? No, I've come to save them. Do you know what's in every frame of your comic? A gripping narrative and hysterical jokes? No. 
Ah, uh, football. And do you know what's all over your shoes? Quality and a painstaking attention to detail. Plates! Your nail art? Football! Your hairdressing? Football! 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 I don't see what that proves. It's just a coincidence. It proves that football has always been your true passion. You put it in everything you do. Oh, come on. What about my ice sculpture, then? Wow. You're right, Daniel. No matter what I do, football always runs through my veins. But that's a good thing, Erico. It means that you're really into your passion. And on top of that, you're a superstar! Oh, yeah? And if I never get my body back, what happens to the superstar then? If I really can't be the best player in the world anymore, what will become of me? The best coach in the world. And anyway, you'll always be a superstar to me. Oh, Daniel. My saxophone? Ditch it. My hand-painted plates? Ditch them. There's just one thing left. Ah! <gasps> Shin guards! Ah! I knew I put them somewhere. <laughs>